I really enjoy reading in my own time um, and obviously there's a lot of that in English. For me personally it makes me a lot more confident in how I talk to people because a lot about English is expressing your own opinions and you know that in English whatever you think your opinion it's never going to be wrong your opinion is valid it's really helped me have more confidence in my own views on things I don't feel afraid to speak up about what I think English lets you express your point of view for me in drama especially like we analyze a lot of plays um, and I think for English uh, it goes really well with that. If you want to go into something like publishing, writing, teaching, anything to do with the humanities or just in general like how to talk to people like social work, I think English really helps you get onto any path that you want. So from the very first moment that the audience walk into the theatre, their expectations are subverted, they are undermined and that continues with the plot of this play. Remember, this play was so controversial for a Victorian audience. It's been adopted in the postmodern era. 21st century audiences love this play. Feminists love this play. It's still put on today. It's celebrated. The English department has really good teachers. Um, I feel like each different teacher has a different way of teaching, but they're all in sync with each other. So if you're doing your coursework, for example, with Mr Tweed, um, he knows how to assist you with that but for example you have Mr Bell Brown who is he has really good knowledge on everything you'll be discussing your book and he'll be able to give you other context points or other things that you can bring into it that you might not necessarily have thought about so I think the teachers are really good at pushing you to get your best but also they're good people to talk to and they make you feel comfortable 